Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my dumpster diving channel. Today, it's like 7.30 in the morning. I just last night, I was like, I'm just gonna wake up super early with the sunrise and go dumpster diving. So, just woke up at the first dump, well, I actually already looked in this one and there's nothing, but at the first dumpster. <laughs> I'm doing primarily retail shops because I love going to them early in the morning before they're open. No pressure of getting caught at all. So let's see what we can find. I have on brand new gloves today. And nothing. Alright, those over there are not anything that I ever look through, so let's keep going. Look at that Texas sunrise. Let's see. Well, this looks like a bunch of that cross stitching stuff I found. A couple of videos ago. These are all used though. like this thing <laughs> but I think it's just a cat toy but it looks kind of cool it's got a bell in there okay let's go up there wow look at that the sunrise is so pretty so this place got new dumpsters Well, they look pretty. Brand new dumpsters. Moving on. Okay, so right across the street, I'm driving over here right now. There's this sewing machine shop, and I've always been really curious about them, but I've never dove there before. Well, now y'all know Alex is like getting really into sewing and everything. And so I'm thinking, I wonder if they like have anything that he would like. So I'm gonna pull in. There's my makeshift tripod for you. <laughs> it doesn't work. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, nothing. Dang, y'all. And it's Thursday. Normally this is a pretty good trash day. Okay, we're having terrible luck with the retail shops. So maybe my trash schedule is not the same or like the trash schedule that I know is not the same for apartments and retail shops, which would make a lot of sense. But Thursdays, normally pretty good for apartment complexes. Thursdays, it's seeming not at all good for retail shops. So let's find something else. Why don't we drive over to the campus and find out. We're going to go to some um, college apartments. Check their dumpsters. <laughs> okay, I'm not entirely ready to give up retail spots yet. So I'm here and maybe there will be something. Well, that's like iron, but I'm gonna leave that. So, all right. 
Let's keep going. Let's see. Um. <laughs> a guitar case. That's really cool. kind of heavy and I don't know if these cases are just always heavy oh wow look at that awesome you guys that's really cool all right so a giant hard shell guitar case I'm gonna go back and look for more though because I think I saw a bag that might have had some stuff in it I don't think there is anything left in there, but I'm really stoked about the guitar case. That is awesome. So first find of the day, not bad. I am excited about retail shops though now. I'm realizing that I think Thursday is trash pickup day, but that's actually really good if I can get to the ones that haven't been picked up yet. Cause see how they like already put the trash can out in front of those doors. It's like not enclosed in there anymore. I think that's because they're making it easier for the trash truck. So I'm just going to keep going because hopefully this is when like the most trash will be out. So let's go see what else we can find. That's the spring in Texas for sure. Just bugs. And these white trees. Those are like some of my favorite trees ever. They're so pretty and they only last for like a week. I love them. All right. I'm at an apartment complex now. Super cool. What is it? A coffee maker? I felt like something. Oh, look, the filter dropped. I love this thing. It doesn't have a little pot with it. Okay, maybe we'll find it. That's so cool. Let's see if we can find the lid or the filter. Okay, here's the filter. Look, y'all, this hasn't even been used. Okay, I moved to another dumpster um, because there was like a maintenance van over by the other dumpster. And so whatever, I'm getting out of the way, but there's clothes in it. So I'm gonna set up my camera and we'll see. Hair. 
but I don't think I'm gonna take that because I don't know how to sell it. <laughs> CBG, this nice jacket. All right, some really nice athletic clothes from the dumpster. <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna go back to that first dumpster in this complex and see if I can find the little um, pot for it. So let's go see if we can find it. I'm back, let's find the little coffee pot. I'm leaving this bag, it's very torn up. couple more things. There we go. Alright. A couple chairs with no backs. Okay, it doesn't look like much. 
Let's go to this one. Look how green the grass is now. It's springtime. Okay, what do we have? This thing, pretty broken. This little iPad case, Betsy John. Oh, no, it's Lily Pulitzer. Those sell so well. for the back of your car maybe for a baby I really don't like where I'm parked so I'm gonna move my car and then go back because there's a lot of stuff in there I also think that I saw like a couple cases of beer <laughs> just like unopened bottles so <laughs> gonna be going back to check that out I like my parking spot a lot more now <laughs> And I brought my bag. So maybe they just didn't like this flavor. safety thing for the outlet this is the second one that's been in here
this box is really in the way. Actually. I'm gonna move it to the recycling bin. Then it's out of the way and it's getting recycled. And this. Okay, y'all, do you think there's more beer in these? Oh my god, there it is. Y'all, look! Why is there so much? This is so weird. Oh, I wonder if someone gave up drinking for Lint. I don't know. So, here's a 30 pack of milk. <laughs> Beer is a really fun one for me to find because we love beer or ciders, whatever these things are. <laughs> we like having this stuff at the house, but it's expensive. And here we go. This is all free. I've now gotten four six packs of the cider and a 30 pack of Miller Lite. certificate holders, three unopened boxes of them. I can definitely use all of this foam sheets for packages. That's awesome. And what's this? And plastic drop cloth. Okay. And now it's time to get those. I can see more all the way in the back. We are going to have a lot of alcohol. Let's see.
we got all of it. <laughs> so here's one bag right here. And then in the car, we've got <laughs> this whole case. This is four six packs. This is 30 beers. That is so funny. And then all of this. go well party at our house it's amazing that's so funny all right not bad well probably nothing is gonna top finding like 70 beers so I'm gonna go home and I'll show you everything all laid out that's seriously so wild I've found wine before um, I have never found beer like cases of beer because it really doesn't go bad that's why i'm wondering if maybe somebody gave it up for lint or maybe maybe they just quit drinking in general or they found it in their teenage kids room or something i don't know that's crazy to throw out that much beer also i'm guessing that those blueberry ciders are gonna taste bad because why else would you throw them all away but i really like that brand i guess i think it was like red what was it <sighs> it's back there I don't know whatever brand that was I've actually had before and I do like them so I'm wondering if maybe I'll like the blueberry one also the <laughs> the way my hair is doing right now reminds me so much of dumpster diving in the summertime because like my hair just gets so frizzy when it's hot outside like if I sweat it all it just like this hair up here like doesn't really grow <laughs> so it's just like little baby like curls everywhere but yeah this is what I look like in the summer I get real sweaty so y'all are gonna get to see that if you haven't been here since last summer you're gonna get to see me in like 110 degrees weather in a dumpster you're welcome <laughs> all right I'm gonna go home I'll see you there I'm back home. Everything is laid out on the table. And then of course, we'll just do a little intermission of Pilgrim. He's playing in the grass, which we need to mow. I tried to come out here and mow yesterday, but our lawnmower won't start. So we have to like clean this part of it and then I'll get to mow this super awesome giant backyard. And the grass just grows nonstop. Alex and I did rock, paper, scissors over who had to mow. <laughs> I lost. <laughs> There's Pilg. Pilgy, come here, boy. Hey, pup, what's up? And if y'all missed it, I did his puppy DNA video. So I'll put it at the top and you can click that if you want to see it. So exciting. <laughs> All right, let's go check out our dumpster finds. Here it is. <laughs> so, I mean, we'll start with the beer. We got one, two, three, four, five and a half six packs of Red's Blueberry Ale. If y'all have tried this, let me know how it is. Okay, so it expired in 2019. But like, cider doesn't expire. Probably same with these beers. December 2019. Wow, so they were like really trusting that date. <laughs> well, there we go. I'll let you know how they taste. But if y'all have ever had these before, let me know. I'm curious about them. I like some of Red's other stuff, like their apple ale, but this blueberry one, I've never tried. So we got five and a half, six packs of that, a 30 pack of Miller High Life. <laughs> We got this witch decor. So I have a giant bag of Halloween stuff from last Halloween. So I'm waiting until this fall to list those. So I'll just put that with those. We got this cool watch. It works. It says it's stainless steel. It's an Armatron. An all sport. It's waterproof cute purple color so there's that these two little cheers mugs they're not in the best condition but they're kind of cute there's this really awesome um what is this called americana collection 
And I guess it's like a little, you know, grill thing, an oven with the coffee pot, which I still didn't find and I'm sad about. But there's the filter in there, never been used it looks like. And then this, I thought it was an easy bake oven at first, but there it is. I think it's a real thing. So there's that. We got the Happiest Baby book with two safety outlet protectors. And this Bricka, hey. This Bricka mirror, I guess, for your car so you can see the little baby while you drive. We got plastic drop cloth, just like a brand new one of those. We got certificate holders. There's, there's 10 in each one of these. So we got 30 total. That's awesome. There's those. And oh, this is gonna be so good for my packaging. This is just like some, um, whatever this stuff is. I mean, it's probably for packaging. It just like wraps it up and protects it. Then this BCBG athletic track jacket is so cool. It's like a racer looking kind of jacket. There's that, it's super cute. Kind of looks like a motorcycle jacket. So we got that and then this, these all need to be washed but this is just another pile of a couple articles of clothing here. This is like a corset um, Spanx style thing, a dress and some more athletic wear. So there we go. I mean, obviously the beer is the highlight. This is so much. I don't know what we're gonna do with all of this, especially if this stuff tastes bad. There we go. And there's Pilg. Just enjoying this weather. Oh, and I forgot the guitar case. Okay, so we got this huge hard shell. Not huge, it's just like standard size. <laughs> but it's this um, hard shell guitar case with a very fuzzy interior. So it looks really nice. A TKL made in Canada. The actual metal part have like some rust on them, but it definitely would still protect your guitar and be perfect for carrying it. So there's that, that was from a guitar shop. Okay, and real quick, I forgot to show this. This is that iPad case that I found in the same dumpster with all the beer. And it's like brand new. It's super clean on the inside. It has like a cute little headphones pocket and it's Lily Pulitzer, which I've seen a lot of people say is like one of the top selling brands on Poshmark. So I'm really excited to have finally found something by her, but we'll see how it sells. The zipper is maybe like getting stuck a tiny bit. But if y'all have any tips for like sticky zippers, <laughs> let me know. Other than that, it's like in perfect condition. So yeah, one last thing. <laughs> All right, well, there you have it. That is my dumpster driving video from today. Basically just a ton of beer. It's like 70 beers. So not bad. <laughs> I'll let you know how the blueberry ale tastes. And thank y'all so much for watching. As always, happy diving and I will see you next time. Bye. Say bye, Pilky. He's so comfortable. Okay, so I decided to end this video with actually trying the blueberry ale. So we'll all get to experience this together. Koozie. Let's see if it pops. Okay. So it still was like carbonated. It smells pretty good. Ready? Cheers. <laughs> Honestly, it's really good. <laughs> it's so good. It's like not a really strong blueberry flavor. I was kind of expecting it to be like so like popsicle-y tasting, you know, it, like or like medicine-y. It's actually really good. Yeah, all right. 10 out of 10 stars. <laughs> I don't know if it needed that many, but it really is not bad. And now I'm glad that we have like 
hundreds of them. <laughs> Hi, Pilk. I wish you could try it. Uh -uh. Hi, boy. <laughs> Hi, boy. What's up? <laughs> okay, well, there you go. The end of this video is me saying that this is actually pretty tasty. And for being free and coming from a dumpster, 10 stars for sure. There we go. All right, that's the actual end of this video. It's like one o'clock now, so I don't feel so bad um, sitting out here and finishing this. So I'll see y'all next time and cheers. <laughs> Happy diving. Bye y'all.